As it's like one or two in the morning. Oh, it's two. Two in the morning. And uh, I want to make a video. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. It's going to be a tarantula video. Okay, so why not? A beautiful Mexican red knee. And still juvenile. But uh, I thought we'd just do a video. And then 10 gallon, which is way too large. But they didn't have any 5 gallons, so... Yeah, I just got her a 10 gallon. She's a mostly calm species, but she can be feisty at times. So I'll go ahead and try to move her over and see what kind of mood she's in. You know what? I'm having difficulties with my ghetto tongs. Okay. Okay, she's in pretty good mood. Is very sprinty species. She loves to sprint. She could be up my arm in a New York minute. And uh, we don't want that, but she's pretty nice, so I highly doubt she'll do that. She's a nice, calm tarantula. I love her. Especially for holding. It's a great beginner tarantula. She does like to kick hairs, which are kind of annoying, but, you know, I'm kind of used to them, so, so that's good. And this lady would not dare throw a threat posture at me. She likes to go at the highest point on your hand. And she will gladly go back down on the dirt if I tell her to. So yeah, that's her handling ability. Surprisingly, this is a desert species and most of them are like dry dirt, something like that dry. But you know, my tarantula is weird. I I left the tongs inside the cage. <laughs> um, she likes very, very moist. Well, for a torrent, for like a for a uh, desert species, she likes a very moist um, cage. Which you know, I don't know why, but she just does. And you know, she can be that way. But. Yeah, she looks very damp. She has a nice hide. I, I still can't believe I left the tongs in there. And uh, she feeds on medium crickets. But she hasn't ate in a while. Just kind of a view from inside her hide. And then, yeah. So once again, this is my Brachypelma smith eye. It's a beautiful species of tarantula. Um, yeah, so I'll see you guys in the next video.